because my campaign is about that. Now, let me talk to you about politics, and that's why I'm here. We've got some great party people in this part of the state, but it hasn't been lost on me and on the leadership of the Texas Democratic Party that we have been losing ground in Nueces County and in this senatorial district. And this year, it's going to be different. This year is going to be different because we have a candidate, Linda Chavez, who will rally the folks in South Texas, and I hope along with me. You see, the leadership of the Democratic Party recruited Linda and me to run. I was retired from politics. I was on my way to San Miguel de Allende on Christmas Eve. I was going to celebrate Feliz Pascua in San Miguel in Guanajuato, right? I got this phone call on Christmas Eve from Harold Cook and says, uh, Senator, what are you doing for about the next year? What do you mean, Harold? He says, well, there's some of us at the party that want you to consider running for Texas Land Commissioner. I said, this is not April Fool's, Harold. <laughs> you know, this is Christmas Eve. He said, no, I'm serious. And I said, okay, you started with, <coughs> with the A's. Uh, <laughs> Representative Alonzo in Dallas. <laughs> He went down to the seas, the Castro brothers, the mayor in San Antonio, and his brother, the state representative. And you got to the age, and you got Senator Hinojosa. And you've gone through the whole legislature. And, you know, the only one that's left is Senator Safarini, and you know what she's going to tell you. So I said, man, you're down to the very bottom of the barrel. And he said, no, Senator, we want you to run. Please stay. Please stay. Don't go. Let me set up a conference call on the 26th, and I want you to talk to the leadership of the Democratic Party, and I'm sure Linda Chavez got the same phone call. Because we want the hemorrhaging to stop in South Texas. Yes. Right. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, we may have effective, eloquent, good leaders like Bill White and Barbara Radnofsky, <coughs> Jeff Weems, that we need Hispanic tickets on the statewide ticket too. Mm -hmm. Because otherwise, Rick Perry's dream of getting 50% of the Hispanic vote, as George W. Bush did, will be realized and we will lose the Texas Democratic Party forever.